Here we go. Chat. We have level three of the Fear 5 Gauntlet, Chronic, and the challenger who is up against him, Lion Blaze. Lion Blaze, one of the best challengers you could ever hope for in this gauntlet that we have. Chronic's going to score right away, though, on an air dribble. Lion Blaze, the best of the best when it comes to 1v1, and he has proven that so far in the gauntlet. Hasn't dropped a single game. Not one to Geno, not one to Sharp, and those guys are not chumps, I tell you what. They are very, very good 1v1 players. Everybody's had a hard time making it through them for the most part, but not Lion Blaze. Lion Blaze breezing right through them both, showing that he is ready for the challenge, but so far in the gauntlet, Chronic has proven to be a step up harder. He has seemed like another level above the rest of these guys. Only ever lost once to Wiz, and he had his bud Drees handle that for him. He's let almost nobody through. Dries says, don't worry, I'll take Wiz out for you. But he cannot rely on his uh, brethren waiting further in the gauntlet, especially not against this guy. He has to take his opportunity to pull Lion Blaze out of the game. A great dribble hook shot from Lion to start. And the story so far with Lion in the gauntlet has been the counterattack, the defensive counterattack, which I think is just Lion's game in ones in general. But his opposition has had a really hard time staying aggressive and keeping Lion Blaze out of their net after shot attempts. But so far, Chronic's been fine with that. And a nice double touch, or not double touch, but a shot you know, on net towards the backboard. Lion has to save it away. Took a big wide angle on the wall. Thought maybe Chronic was going to take it up the side wall, but instead cut it in field. Lion not able to get there. And a 2-1 lead for Chronic. Chronic is back in the Dominus. And we have seen some of the nastiest play in 1v1s uh, from Chronic in the Dominus. He's played the entire gauntlet so far in the Octane, though, I'm pretty sure. And chat can correct me if that's craziness. But I'm pretty sure he's been back in his Octane, even though for a long time he played all Dominus on our stream. He'll get a third. Nice counterattack. The shot from Lion is just dead center. And... Uh, Chronic's going to have absolutely no trouble saving that one away. A pretty risky shot from Lion as he's falling across the field, not continuing that touch at all, and so far away from the net with a waiting defender. But we'll see. Chronic, one of the best offensive players in the game. Lion Blaze, known for his defense. Which one will be able to win out? You still have to think that Lion Blaze is favored the way he's played once as a late. Chronic, a nice musty flip reset. And that last touch, yeah, he's not even going to go. This is the way it's gone for Lion. Lion's so good on defense, he gets his free nets when he's able to stop people. And, and Chronic almost got that last 50. The last 50 just barely, barely outside off the post. Chronic ripping one off kickoff. He has a one goal lead. Not able to grab that midfield boost. So Lion is going to be able to close the distance and confidently play some defense here. Lion has switched it up. A close shadow. He had been trying to play defense basically from in his net in the early part of this game. But instead, he comes for the shadow play. Can Chronic get back to this one? He should be able to. It's all about that boost grab. And he's not going to be able to get it. But he'll stick with this ball on zero boost and get a decent shot attempt, but he needs very smart play to cut back towards that ball. He didn't have time to grab boost. He also didn't have time to go for another touch, apparently. He didn't realize Lion was coming quick from the corner. Chronic trying to stay greedy. Didn't want to have to play against Lion with zero boost. Had Lion made an outplay at midfield. Thought he had an opportunity to just cut it off before and not have to deal with the huge discrepancy in boost that he was gonna have. Chronic the demo, lots and lots of space. He's lethal, but he needs to do what he's normally very, very good at, which is making sure the shot attempts are not um, all in place. Need to be able to recover from a missed shot or a failed attempt. And Chronic, one of the best at doing that. But you'll get demoed here at midfield, never really got a great shot off and got caught. Lion has worked his way back in. The early lead from Chronic has finally been erased as Lion takes the lead. Lion spent 5.5K on his alpha. 
Sheesh, man. People pay a lot of money for Alpha Boost nowadays. But Lion Blaze makes a lot of Rocket League money, so he can do whatever he wants. Nice demo. Chronic used to rush his ball to the net. I'm surprised he's taking such a scenic route, but he'll end up... Oh my goodness, what a save from Lion Blaze. I was going to say he's going to end up scoring anyways. But Lion's able to keep it out. Chronic does not get quite enough height on it. Wow, a great boost steal, but at the cost of getting scored on. Lion, man, he just finds a way to score. So many open nets. So many shots created for himself at midfield that result in the simplest of touches. The man doesn't need to be accurate at all because he knows how to create open nets for himself. Chronic not able to get any power on the flick, but he'll go straight up in the air. Lion Blaze, I think, pre flipped that. Chronic, a nice flip reset shot. I think Lion tried to pre-jump this at first. Oh, no, he just flipped out to midfield. Trying to pick up every pad he can, but too little too late. Chronic had styled on him. Brought it back within one with a minute left to go. Lion Blaze, a flick on the kickoff. Not quite in. Chronic, a great recovery on his challenge. He's got a lot of boost. He should be able to get a fifth. If he misses wide, he'll hate himself, but he didn't. Sorry you're lurking today, watching the draft. I see, I see NFL draft going on right now. Chat, imagine caring about real sports and not just car soccer. Cringe. It's okay, we'll forgive him. Chronic able to take that back corner boost, but sat frozen in the corner. Seemed to think... That was the best play. Just waiting for a line to tap the ball to him. Chronic, once again, lots of space. And I'm telling you right now, the story of the game will be whether or not Chronic takes safe enough shot attempts when Lion baits him into making these plays. Because Chronic does love to go up in the air, take a risky flip reset. And that is just, you know exactly what Lion Blaze is baiting. He's such a good defender and he wants players to make that mistake. This dribble is looking really good from Chronic. It's gonna get saved away. No way can Lion get under it and take this all the way. He can't. So overtime in game number one, Lion versus Chronic. Chronic trying to get yet another defense in this gauntlet. Maybe the toughest challenger he's played so far, but he has looked really, really good. A nice adjustment on a single jump as Lion Blaze is trying to clear the ball away. Really good mechanics from Chronic. He's going to get a little pop from his musty flick. My goodness. Lion should be stuck really low on boost, but Chronic couldn't cut around in time. That fake has gotten Lion in the air. Lion has to go back to his back line. Can Chronic clutch it when it counts? The man can. The offensive powerhouse has done it against the defensive mastermind. A lot of great flicks and good pressure here as this overtime finishes. Lion trying to cut the ball early. Not going to work against Chronic. As he gets the game one win, Lion Blaze's undefeated streak of games is over as Chronic takes game number one. Chronic versus Lion Blaze. Chronic able to do what the defenders before him were not, and that is win at least a single game. Lion might win out for the rest of these. Oh my goodness, what a five head play. Lion diving into the corner off kickoff, stealing this boost. Has that back camera check, sees Chronic coming in to make a challenge, and just forces him to basically own goal as Chronic slaps the ball off of Lion, getting that slight single jump to make sure the pinch went straight in the net. Insane, heady play from Lion. And that's exactly what you expect out of Ghost Gaming's best 1v1er. Strong flick from Chronic. He's going to come. Continue to force the issue and able to flick it above Lion. Lion, not a bad recovery at all. Decided not to insta challenge Chronic and instead power slid about a flick distance away from Chronic, and that ended up being the mistake that gets him scored on. Lion Blaze up high, looking for a double. Nice shot. Needed to keep this one away from Chronic. Even Chronic will give him the nice one. 
Chronic lobbing it up to the wall. If you're going to score on a double tap, you have to keep the ball far, far away from the defender. And he does a great job of getting a good connection right above the crossbar on the far left side of the net. And then tapping it in left side as well. Make sure Chronic can't get there. The direct kickoff not going to go well for Chronic. Lion's going to be given lots of space. And he is not going to play on the wall. And he just totally baited Chronic into coming in for that challenge. You see so many ones players dribble the ball over to the side wall to make a play. Chronic tried to take it away as soon as he could. But Lion's not taking it to the wall. That's not his style. He cuts it in field and Chronic goes flying away. Chronic, nice quick play. A good save as Lion tried to create something off the kickoff and just a quick turnaround and a great shot off the wall for a second. Lion Blaze, soft chip on net. Saw a situation where saving even a single jump height shot was going to be really awkward for Chronic. So figured, chip the ball on him, save as much boost as possible, and see if the continuation ends up scoring. Chronic actually almost helped that one in. Lion did not have the double. But Chronic almost created a wall for him to score off of. Nice shot from Lion. The continuation is there. The eventual outplay will come as Chronic starved in net. Looking for anything he can. Ends up being slightly out of position since he had to drive out to grab that pad to have the boost to make it up in the air. Lion launching this one downfield despite no boost means Chronic, oh my goodness, should have a wide open possession, but that bounce could not have possibly gone better for Lion. Killing so much time, letting him pick up these boosts here on Chronic's half and not have to completely retreat. That being said, eventually it will be Chronic Possession. Another nice 45 degree flick forces another high save. And right now Chronic has found a way to score on these continuations in the past. Will he be able to do it again here? One flip reset, two potentially? No. Might not have mattered anyways if he had the second. I don't think he was going to be able to cover the distance to the ball. Lion lobbing this one on the backboard, trying to waste as much of Chronic's boost as he can. Chronic doing a good job feathering and preserving where possible. Nice outplay. Chronic has gotten a couple quick plays at midfield that have surprised Lion. Watch this from Lion's perspective. He thought he saw an opportunity of this ball coming off the wall to take it away. But Chronic, a good read, zips under it and taps it over halfway through this game. Worked his way to just down one. Not a bad sign for him as this game started heavily in favor of Lion. But man, what great placement. This shouldn't necessarily be a goal, but Lion doing such a good job of putting it crossbar down, and Chronic can't get there. Wave dash kickoff for Chronic, almost a disaster. But now he's got possession with lots of space. He's had good reads on Lion Blaze's fakes so far, not falling for any of these pre challenges. Can't catch this ball and he can't catch the lion. He's trying to take him out, but he's going to end up starving out all of his boost in the process. And now he's going to flip sillily in front of the ball. Lion just has to sit and wait and get a sixth. Chronic just going all in on being able to either steal possession or mostly demo lion. He thought for sure he could catch up, but good avoidance, which led to Chronic being in an awkward spot with zero boost. And the shot was inevitable. Lion taken away once again by the speed of Chronic. Cannot seem to hang on these midfield challenges. Doesn't realize how fast Chronic is going to be coming. A minute 51 left to go. Chronic, I don't think he's led a single time in this game. He's brought it down to one for a moment right around the midpoint of the game. Needed that bump on Lion after the awkward flick. Couldn't connect. Lion not going to the wall. Never going to the wall and doesn't need to. Finds a way to score at midfield. Chronic trying to close the distance going perfectly laterally 
on the field makes it so, so hard to win out of 50 in a favorable direction. The uh, addition of their two angles is always going to be in favor of Lion when Chronic is taking such a 90 degree angle route on the field. Lion flick from midfield, forcing a tough save. Chronic has to get a clear, and he's done enough to keep Lion glued to the ground. And he needs a flip reset here to end it, and it still doesn't matter. He got extra speed, but not the height he was going to need to get it past Lion. A minute left to go. Chronic needs a little bit of a scoring frenzy here. A great 50 to pervert, preserve this possession. Quick dribble. Trying to take it low. Gets Lion to miss. Can he find the angle? He can't. That touch, he needed it bad, and that might be the touch that was necessary to come back. Maybe not. Chronic finds a nifty way to score, a nice slow musty to make Lion miss on the back wall. If he rips this with speed, then Lion gets the save. Or maybe not, he kept it high enough. As long as he kept it high, which that slow musty did. Chronic direct kickoff, a little bit too strong. 30 seconds left to go. Might have found a way to get in the net here. He can't seem to demo Lion, though. Lion's so resilient. 22 seconds. A great 50 in front of his net. Should buy him some corner boost, but he'll die. And Lion doesn't even seem too interested in shooting. He just wants to waste a little bit more time. Never mind. He'll eventually score. Wanted to take a trip out to midfield. Pass it to himself off the backboard. Chronic taking a trip into the corner despite no boost being there. So game number two, gonna go to Lion Blaze. Lion not once giving up the lead this whole time. I think three might be the biggest lead he's had. So finishing in a uh, dominant fashion, he'll bring it up to four, make it look like a blowout. But everybody watching knew it was close down to the end. Lion needed to get, or sorry, Chronic needed to get a little risky. And that's what ended up pushing the scoreline just a little bit higher. But Lion Blaze will tie it up. One to one against Chronic, the third defender. Chat. Lion Blaze versus Chronic. One to one in game series. Chronic going to lose the kickoff immediately in game number three. Has no interest in trying to recover after making that mistake. Looking for a wave dash kickoff and slightly delaying it. And uh, it's not going to work. Not a bad idea to mix the kickoff normally. Mix up the kickoff, that is. Not going to go in favor of Chronic this time. Flip reset. Taken to the ground. No reason to use that shot attempt until forced to. But, dude, it doesn't matter. Lion Blaze will find a way to get the save and get the counter. He'll stay very, very patient. And Chronic, he needed to place the ball somewhere other than where Lion already was and he tried to get around it and move it best he could but ended up shooting it just right at the defender Chronic ceiling reset taken away by Lion too long of a setup ooh Chronic I think he saw an opportunity to potentially punish Lion as Lion had a chance to steal that back corner boost thought maybe Lion was going to go try and take it away and he could cut in field and rush it back but Lion too smart defensive focus not going to overcommit in any of these situations and he's running it up here at the start of this game number three 3-0 three in 40 seconds a couple good quick kickoff plays and defensive setups and he has got himself one of the biggest leads he's had all series yet again and it took him no time at all Chronic off the backboard. Lion is going to be able to tap it away. Oh, and not able to grab the boost either for Chronic. He has just stopped moving. A little frustrated. But somehow his stop moving plays have actually not been too bad for him. He's ended up being in the right spot. So uh, maybe he's five head for dropping his controller. He'll eventually get scored on though. And staying quick might have prevented this situation. 4-0 for Lion. He's running it up. And not a bad idea against the high scoring offense of Chronic. Get as much buffer as possible.
Chronic trying to go back to what he was doing before. These double jump aerials were so quick for him. He was able to beat Lion a bunch of times at midfield with it earlier. His set plays haven't been as effective as normal, and that's because he's going up against such a great defender. The fact that Lion found a way to 50 that ball out of his net, he took it so, so close to his net. Chronic just has to win that even in the slightest fashion, and that ball's going in. But somehow, Lion keeps it perfectly lateral, and it stays out. Chronic aggressive on the kickoff. Not able to grab the corner, and Lion's going to make him pay. Taking a trip out to midfield. Thinks he has an opportunity to punish Chronic, and he does. Great read of the defense by Lion Blaze. Chronic wanting to close the distance just a little bit. Has his car faced out towards midfield instead of back towards the net. And Lion sees a slight opening to slot it in above him. 5-1 lead, not even halfway through the game. Still lots of time for Chronic to come back. But Lion looking so, so confident. When you combine the way he started this game number three with the end of game number two as well, it's just looked all Lion for the past many, many minutes. Chronic gonna get a nice chip shot off the crossbar and out. I don't think it costs too much boost for Lion to make that save attempt. And Chronic, man, he's just he's psyching himself out with Lion Blaze and the net. Trying to uh, come up with a creative way to get it past him because he's done such a good job of stopping him that he ends up almost just outplaying himself and not even really taking any shot attempt at all. Because he's so sure that if he were to, that Lion would just save it and counter him. Ooh, Lion. He is going to regret that if somehow... Chronic comes back in this four goal deficit in the last few minutes. He's gonna go for the bump, almost surely. Nice play from Chronic. A great bounce is what's gonna lead to this goal here. Ends up not using the flip, didn't really have an opportunity to, but the bounce is so, so high, it's going to top corner. It makes Lion Blaze very, very predictable in how he has to save it. He has no choice but to try and meet him in that corner so Chronic can just bump him out of the way. Couple touches here from Chronic that are quick. You can put him all of a sudden only two goals out, man. That that is a huge swing. A minute forty left to go, and four goals is a lot of goals. But a nice play and a quick one right after, and we got another game. Chronic up in the air. He loves it too much. Going back to Old Faithful. The fifty this time will score. Chronic speeding up the air dribble. Forcing Lion to make the save earlier than he normally would. He's played these dribbles really, really slow. This time, he's going to rush it and try and win out the 50 right in front of the net. Lion has been trying to make saves on his goal line all game. So rushing that ball and giving it some extra speed going into the 50 is not a bad idea. And he has got himself back in this one. Minute left to go, down one, but Lion's going to win the kickoff. Chronic needs to find a way to grab boost in the corner. Stay in this one. Ooh, a close challenge. Almost lost. Lion's going to take a greedy shot. Chronic might be able to take this the other way. You know Lion is going to be recovering as fast as he can, but will he be able to save a lethal Chronic? He can't! Oh my goodness, Chronic! One of the most clutch shots I've ever seen. Such a tough shot. Down one with a minute left to go, but he rips it crossbar down on the musty. My goodness, Chronic. Bringing himself all the way back. In a very crucial game number three. The beginning of the game was all Lion Blaze. But this second half has been Chronics. A fake kickoff or a delayed kickoff, I should say, from Lion is going to get him this first possession. He's got Chronic playing on low boost and he's coming off the air with 22 boost. He has to be perfect in this situation if he doesn't want to get counterattacked. And he might not quite be perfect. A great pinch. He's going to die for it. No way that he score. Did Chronic do it? Chronic! What are you doing? An absolute genius as he pinches the ball from his corner. Dies, but who cares? Right inside the left post.
Peronic has the biggest brain we've ever seen and will go up 6-5 with 23 seconds left to go. Lion Blaze has to find a way to score here in the last few moments and why not go to the air dribble bump? It's not going to work. Chronic might be able to get a 7th. Chronic, has he done it? This game was all Lion Blaze at the start. But Chronic is a new man here in the second half. And a two-goal lead with 10 seconds left to go. Oh my goodness, that pinch and shot from Chronic to tie it up and take the lead. A potential well-deserved win here in this game number three. Unless Lion is able to score a two-pointer here. It should be over. Chronic, what a game. As he will take the 2-1 lead and put himself on double match point. Head of the game number four. Chat. Game four, Chronic with the heroics at the end of game number three to take the lead, trying to end yet another challenger's run in level three versus Chronic. A nice flick to start the game, and he'll take the 1 0 lead this time in game number four. Lion electing to head back to his corner, play defense on the shadow like he's done so many times this game. But it's not going to work in a big ol' whiff on the kickoff. I wonder how this server is for Lion Blaze. Probably used to having to play this stuff on US East, but he does have 90 ping. Must be a California kid like Dries. Huge rip from Lion. The double, not there. Lion has picked up the speed on offense. That's the kind of shot that we just weren't seeing from Lion earlier in the series. I wonder if that last game has gotten in his head a little bit. This, this is a reversal of roles. That was Lion ripping a shot that Chronic would normally go for, and then Chronic taking the free counterattack, which is normally what Lion's doing. So if those kind of shots are going to start going in favor of Chronic, it could spell disaster for Lion. He needs to stick with his game. I think that might have been a little bit of an anomaly in game number three. No reason to uh, insanely switch it up. It's worked well for him so far in the gauntlet. But my goodness... That was just a performance you can't beat from Chronic. Nice shot from AJ to start this one. Or sorry, from AJ, from Lion Blaze. A good angle. Chronic awkward in that corner, picking up that boost, and he needed to be punished. Lion is actually my neighbor. Is that right? Am I going to pull a James bot and join a team instead of spectate? No, I never do that. I actually do the opposite now. When people want to play, I accidentally go to spectate. Oh, Chronic. Chronic's falling in love with the pinch chat. He, he thought, what if? What if? <laughs> what if I slapped a pinch off the ceiling for another goal? It's not going to work, though. But can you blame him for trying to be a hero? Lion, a nice delayed 45-degree flick with expert placement. He's going to force Chronic into own goaling. I think that was out of the net. You didn't know Lion Blaze was US West? Lion, a direct kickoff goal off the wall. So the momentum has stopped now from Chronic, I would say. A few goals for Lion Blaze, able to take the lead here in game number four. The steam has worn off. The heat checks are over. That was certainly a heat check. That pinch off the ceiling was Chronic seeing if he had actually become the greatest all-time player. Chronic with lots of open field. Feeling good right now. Going to go further with the first air dribble bump we've seen from him. Oh, no, he's going to save it himself. He had no choice. He sat there staring at the ball. He accidentally fell into it to give it a soft touch. And once he did, the ball was rolling out. And he had to just sit and think about his life and how there's nothing he could do to scoop it back on line. Lion, a great scoop flick himself. He's going to get the continuation. It didn't seem like he was going to. But he finds a way. Oh my goodness, absolutely ripping a flick to the moon. Chronic can't recover in time. Lion kickoff shot, wow, Chronic just barely saving it away. Able to tip it out. Lion hiding behind the ball. Chronic will take an immediate flick and Lion's gonna try what he does best. And he's going to continue to be the best to do it. 
operating on very, very little boost, but such quick touches back to the net. Even guys like Chronic, so fast, so aware, still can't get back in time for a Lion Blaze counter. And another kickoff goal. Lion is running it up 6 2 in favor of Lion. Another big lead, but chat, we saw it before. Chronic has Lion right where he wants him. In fact, he wants to do it this time from down five. He said, I did it last game from down four. This time, I'm gonna do it from down five. A nice direct chip straight into the net for that last kickoff goal. Lion being aggressive on the kickoff and is actually still hovering down here on Chronic's side despite not being able to grab either boost. So now he's stuck in a low boost situation. Chronic is not gonna go for the air dribble bump that I would have expected. A lot of players in that situation when they uh, starve their opponent out, that we go next. Chronic has had enough of game number four. He's gonna forfeit with two minutes, 13 seconds left to go. An early forfeit, not something we've never seen from Chronic. Yeah, sir. Here we go. Game five. Chronic versus Lion Blaze. Lion gonna get a new server. As part of the uh, forfeit from Chronic, we have to end the game and start another one, which is maybe, you know, not the play. Lion Blaze didn't have the best of servers there, rocking 90 ping. Now, rocking 90 ping, so never mind, chat. It, it's completely irrelevant. We probably got the same exact server. That being said, game five. Wow, Chronic has given us some of the best matchups we've seen in a long, long time. And I'm sure he would love to not have to rely on Dries and Daniel to keep Lion from making it through the gauntlet. A great bounce dribble, Chronic just hovering behind this ball. If Lion is gonna sit in net, he will wait to take the shot as late as he can. And too much heat, Lion won't even jump. He knows when he's beat. Chronic losing this kickoff, but back into his corner. A great jump on the demo attempt from Lion. Trying to play patiently, but he's in a really awkward spot with low boost. But the patience pays off as that ball clears across him in the net. Has the wherewithal not to pull the trigger. Oh my goodness, Chronic! <laughs> the man is definitely heating up once again. Chronic, the double touch right above Lion. He actually ended up shooting it right where Lion was, but too much heat as he gets his second here in game five. Going up to Lion Blaze has definitely won the kickoff game in general though. The oh my goodness, the man can't miss. Everything's going his way. Lion Blaze crossbar and down, but of course it's out because Chronic has paid the Rocket League gods to have everything go in his favor. Another flick on net. Chronic saves it away. Trying to take a slight trip out to grab another pad. He will continue to make saves with as little boost as he possibly can. As he puts himself up 2-0. A minute and 30 in. Lion having a tough time getting past the defense of Chronic. Chronic playing so, so confident. Stuck deep on Lion's half with low boost. These are situations that Lion almost always is able to turn in his favor. A great fake from Chronic, but once again, Lion Blaze knows what he's doing. Has enough boost to pull back down onto the ground. Both these guys able to reset in respective corners. Chronic trying to shoot near post, can't do it. Lion gets the save and intentionally flipping through the ball into that midfield boost to make sure he takes the boost advantage but a slight miss on the shot. Lion Blaze has been inches away on so many different ones, but he's finally done what he does best. Earned himself a wide open net, and that will shake off the rust here in this game number five. A great kickoff win. I really think the kickoffs for Lion Blaze are gonna be a big key here. They've definitely gone majority in his favor.
Lion just pounding the net over and over again. He will eventually work it past Chronic. Chronic has been handling it pretty well so far. But the barrage is just too much. Eventually, Lion will sneak it by inside the near post. Chronic earned a possession on kickoff. Has the ball midfield. Lion winning in net like he's done so many times. The air dribble bump will get Lion to miss. Lion focusing on not getting taken out of the air. Cannot get to the ball. Tried to come in from above but not able to do it. Chronic, a direct kickoff goal. This is looking good for Chronic. If he can even these up, take some direct plays, he might be able to secure it here. In the last two minutes, I think a lot of people watching this series when they saw the names of the challengers at the start, had the most faith in Lion Blaze here to potentially make it all the way. Chronic wants to show that he's still one of the best of the best as he gets yet another goal. Lion missing that touch at midfield, trying to get a soft touch into a roll to himself instead. Misses it, lets Chronic have another one. Lion, this direct kickoff goal saved away. Chronic, another outplay. Lion is searching on offense right now. Playing a little bit desperate. Not normally his style to be this aggressive. And Chronic has been able to punish him. Up 6-2. A four-goal lead for Chronic. Chronic has shown it's more than possible to come back from four goals in this amount of time. He did it in spectacular fashion a couple games ago. Lion Blaze... Gonna need to have similar energy, but Chronic will run it up. 7-2. Lion Blaze so clinical, so perfect every time we've seen him play. Starting to make misreads as he doesn't get this touch on the back wall. Chronic playing this one into the corner, able to beat Lion out. Every little thing right now is just going Chronic's way. Lion trying to be aggressive, trying to steal this corner boost. A very, very close matchup. Really felt like it could have gone either way. But Chronic gets the 100 because he has been blessed by the Rocket League Lord of Luck. Well, that undersells Chronic's performance. It is not luck. The man is absolutely on fire right now. Lion Blaze chipping one from the corner to the net every second that ticks off the clock. Six goals left to go. That demo kills so much time. Lion will give the GG's in chat a ninth for Chronic. And Chronic will end yet another run. Has officially confirmed nobody will stop more challengers than Chronic. He has stopped four of the five that he has faced. And considering at least one has been stopped by somebody else, it is official Chronic has stopped the most of anybody chronic 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 proving to be too much to handle wants to know did he do it did, did he beat everybody no he still has a couple more but my goodness chronic absolutely the gatekeeper of the gauntlet oh man the performances chronic has put on in this series in this uh in this you know whole tournament matchup I'm trying to think of the word gauntlet i guess is a good word Sheesh.